Still sticking to South Africa, my latest project, uh, Liberty, it's a Danish miniseries. It's five episodes uh, that was being shot in South Africa, in, in and around Pretoria. So uh, how I got my role on Liberty, it's, it was amazing. So when I played, when I did my role in Watu Water, uh, one of the production managers on, on Watu Water uh, we became really good friends and as I was saying before like always put out your best when in whatever you do because you never know who might be watching so a few months later after at water a casting call comes across her desk and they're looking for either a Kenyan or a Tanzanian who fits my profile so I got together with her and my agent Isaiah and we we uh, we made tapes and then we sent them through and um it went quiet like for three weeks. We thought, ah, oh, okay, we tried, we didn't get it. Then three weeks later, they, they just call out of the blue. They go like, oh yeah, wait, where's Charlie now? He got the part. We need him down in SA. We're like, wait, you waited this long to tell us. But anyway, it was a mad rush. Got my visa, went down to SA. That was in June. And in June, we, because it's five episodes, in June, we shot two episodes because every episode was taking about two and a half weeks to shoot, roughly. So we shot two and a half episodes in June and then September, between September and early November, we shot the last three. And I was there for the, the entire period um, of shooting. And I have to say, life was different. I was, I felt like a star, like we were put up in this, I believe it was a four star, if not a five star hotel. So like, let me just say I was living lavish, and it, it's sort of it's it's a different life as an actor. You you always dream about how the how life as an actor will be, like just focusing on your, on your craft, doing nothing else, because that's that's what Hollywood sells. That that's what actors do. They just this artistic people who do nothing else but focus on their art. But then you become an actor in Kenya and then you realize that's not how it is. You need to do this plethora of all, all these things to just stay afloat. So there, uh, because I was, I, I was in a foreign country and just I was, I, I'd been shipped there to work. That's all I was doing. So on my off days, I was just studying the script or hanging out with fellow cast members, just learning more about the script, reading the book that was based on, because Liberty is based on the book. And apart from that, just being on holiday, like going down to the pool, swimming around, just having fun. And it was it was an amazing experience because you you get to work with all these international acts. Uh, it was a Danish it's a Danish production, so a lot of the main cast were like big uh, big successful actors, names, A list actors in Denmark. We uh, Ma Maunus Krepa, we have Sophia Grabel, and there's a lady, Connie Nielsen. She's an amazing Danish actress who's gone into Hollywood now. She plays in Wonder Woman. She's Wonder Woman's mother, Hippolyta. So if you've watched Wonder Woman, she's the she's the blonde lady kicking kicking everyone's butt. So I got to work with this amazing uh, cast and an amazing crew, and I really got to see got to see like how how filming and how filmmaking should look like in its essence like how it should it should look in ideal conditions i got to see how that looks and i have to say it was beautiful